Hello and welcome back to your own channel Indian Defense Analysis where we bring to you all the latest development happening in the defense sector. The Prime Minister Sri Narendra Modi has unveiled H-30-40, an indigenous trainer aircraft designed and developed by HAL in Defense Expo on 19th October. The aircraft has a state-of-art contemporary system and has been designed with pilot-friendly features. With more than 60% of in-house parts and collaboration with private industry, it is a shining example of Aat Nirbhar Bharat. The H-30-40 would be used for basic flight training, aerobatics, instrument flying, and close formation flights, whereas its secondary roles would include navigation and night flying. The aircraft is testimony of HL's cutting-edge technology designed to meet the primary training requirements of Indian Defence Services. It is built around a meticulously tested turboprop engine and the aircraft is equipped with latest avionics. It features all-metal tandem seat with a bubble canopy and a T-tail configuration. It also includes a reconditioned cockpit, zero-zero ejection seats and multi-function displays. It features a retractable tricycle landing gear system with a steerable nose wheel. The aircraft boasts the unique features like running changeover of pilots, hot refueling and short turnaround time. All the tests required for certification of the aircraft have been completed in a record timeline of six years from its first flight and this is a very huge achievement. H-2040 has been designed to meet the PSQR issued by Indian Air Force and FR-23 standards. It has met all the PSQR performance parameters with a gross weight of 3050 kgs. The aircraft has completed all the system tests, all PSQR performance tests, hot weather, sea level and crosswind trials and user assisted technical trials. It has also demonstrated rainwater resistance. The aircraft has received provisional clearance for airworthiness from the Center of Military Airworthiness and Certification. Now going more in depth of its capability, it is powered by TPE331 12B engines which can deliver 40 hours of flying for the same cost which is needed to fly an F-16 or MiG-29 for an hour which kind of explain why the aircraft has got number 40 in its name. The aircraft can fly at 600 km per hour and reach an altitude of 6 km. It has capability to be converted into armed and weaponized version at later stage. With a maximum takeoff weight of 2800 kg, the trainer can be configured to carry a gun, rocket and bomb to perform the light combat or counter-insurgency missions. HAL has also successfully integrated the lithium battery on s 40 and making it the first in the continent using lithium battery for military aviation. On 4th February 2021, an RFP for 70 S-2040 aircraft was received from Indian Air Force with additional clause of 38. Taking into the capability of the proposed turboprop aircraft, market studies, upgrade functionality etc. There is a requirement of 290 aircraft, 70 from Air Force and 220 aircraft from other customers. On 1st March 2023, the Union Cabinet has approved procurement of 70 S-2040 basic trainer aircraft for Indian Air Force at a cost of Rs 6,828.36 crore. The aircraft will be supplied over a period of 6 years. S-2040 will boost Indian Air Force capability and recommend for Stage 1 trainer aircraft. Air Force currently relies on its fleet of piloted PC-7 from Switzerland. This was today's update. Please let us know your views on this in comment section. If you like the video, do not forget to like, share and subscribe. With this, I would like to say goodbye and Jai Hind. We'll soon back with more interesting and amazing development happening in the defense sector.